particularly we the Pentagon, the is days. not impressed. Correspondent Rich Edson has the alarming specifics from the State Department tonight. A new Russian nuclear-powered missile, unlimited range, unpredictable trajectory, invincible against missile defense, all according to the Russian government. A video animation shows this missile cruising around international defenses and headed towards the west coast of the United States. Standing in front of that video and boasting of these claimed advances, Russian President Vladimir Putin. No one wanted to speak with us constructively. No one has listened to us. You listen to us now. At his annual State of the Nation address, Putin also unveiled other claimed Russian advances. A senior State Department official says it was deeply unfortunate to watch a video depicting a nuclear attack on the U.S. Ministers will probably pick it up in a few minutes on the oncoming judgment. And I hope they do anyhow. On the oncoming judgment. Because the whole world is ready to, is quivering. Every nation is quivering. Don't you think that Russia isn't quivering too? The United States and the islands are quivering. Who's going to throw that first atomic bomb? When it does, it may throw the whole thing out of cater and not be a cobalt bomb. Watch the few of them's that lose. There won't be even a fire and insect on the face of the earth left. It's right now in the hands of wicked, sinful, hellbound man. And your destination of this earth's journey, I said earth's journey, is left to the hands of wicked and sinful men. Amen. Amen. You better watch where your soul's destination is Amen. pledged for. If it isn't pledged towards heaven and towards God, turn tonight with all your heart. And don't let the old year pass away without you turning to God. For your earthly destination is determined by the hands of wicked and cruel cold-hearted, atheotic man. That's where your body is determined. Whatever they want to do about it now, that finishes you up. God be merciful. Now, then after that I turned and looked, and I saw this in the United States burning like a smolder. Rocks had been blown up, and it was burning like a, a heap of fire and logs or something that just set it afire and looked as far as I could see and she'd been blown up. And then the vision left me.